in the summertime when you want cooling, you're taking heat out of the building. When you try to compress it, it wants to release heat. So it releases heat into the ground. The way the refrigeration cycle works is you expand and contract Freon or the refrigerant. And any heat, even your refrigerator is a one-way heat pump, if you want to look at it that way. It's, it's letting the refrigerant expand and contract. The refrigerant is allowed to expand inside your, your refrigerator and take the heat that's in your refrigerator and then it goes to the outside of your refrigerator where it's compressed in your little compressor at the bottom of your refrigerator typically. And that is then, that's why when you stand near your, your fridge and put your hand by the side or back of it, it feels warm. That heat used to be in the refrigerator. In wintertime when you want heat in the building and it's 55 degrees, 55 degrees is cool. Well, right now it's about that for us in this, when we're taking this video. It feels cool to us because we run much warmer than that as human beings. But a mechanical system, 55 degrees, is pretty warm in terms of it takes that 55 degrees that has heat energy in it and then it wrings it out in the refrigerant cycle and it moves it up to the temperature you want it to be by the process of squeezing the heat out of it. It's like a sponge. It soaks up the water, the heat down below, brings it up here, squeezes out the heat or the water and then that goes into the building. Even though it's only 55 down there and you want it to be 75 up here, as you compress it, it gets to 75 and hotter.